Hello everyone, and welcome to my General Hospital official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sunny requests Carly's information for an emergency meeting Sam's assignment from Dante. According to General Hospital, Brooke Lynn Quartermain will learn about some major emergency, leaving her to wonder what is going on as she rushes into the deception office. Gladys Corbin will be present to maybe admit that Sasha Gilmore isn't doing well and will continue to be in a precarious position because of Dr. Damon Montague's extortion. In terms of Lucy Coe, she will inform Maxie Jones about any nasty attempts to bring them down. Rook Lin will hear this unsettling information from Maxie and Lucy, and he or she would understand Tracy Quartermain has used her influence over the corporation once more. Naturally, Tracy has a mysterious ally involved in all of this, so as this exciting narrative develops, more information will become available. Don Falconeri will approach Sam McCall across town and request a favor. That might entail keeping an eye on Cody Bell and, if necessary, talking some sense into him. Based on Cody's actions in the Thursday's GH preview video, it's likely that he'll continue to work hard to get accepted to Ferncliff so he can assist Sasha. Dant surmised that was the cause of Cody's recent irrational outburst at the PCPG. Cody is going to be acting out at the Quartermain stables right now, where he'll urge Max Scorpio to handcuff him. While Cody is being urged to stop trying to get himself committed for Sasha's sake, Sam could arrive and send Mac away. Jordan Ashford will pay Curtis Ashford a visit at his rehabilitation center. Jordan might acknowledge that she had a more personal goal, as well as Curtis inquires as to whether she traveled so far to check on his progress. We'll see whether Jordan can persuade Curtis to open up since she'll want to know how he's adjusting to his paralysis and all the changes in his life. Trina Robinson will be perplexed by a response Spencer Cassidine gives her at the gallery. Trina is interested in Spencer's living arrangements and how they may change after Laura Collins and Kevin Collins return, but Spencer might not be entirely sure what to anticipate. Perhaps if Spencer would like to live alone or perhaps with Trina, things are uncertain at the moment because of the circumstances with Esm Prince and Ace Cassidine. Spencer will ultimately confide some of his troubles to Trina, so hopefully that will ease the tension that arises around Esm at least for the time being. Sunny Corintos will drop by Kelly's and inquire about Carly Spencer's visit to Pentonville, but she will likely become irritated by all of his inquiries. Sunny might be reminded by Carly that he insisted his most recent favor came with no conditions. Carly may get the impression that Sunny is watching her or attempting to keep an eye on her, which isn't what she wants. Sunny will nonetheless warn of the threat and might be concerned that Carly would become involved in Drew's drama. Even though Sunny is trying his part to keep Drew, Carly, and everyone else safe, mistakes could still happen. Keep watching the ABC soap, according to General Hospital, as some daring mob actions are still to come in Port Charles. Lucy freaks out, Cody loses it, Sunny grills Carly, and Curtis is surprised. Jordan Ashford stops at the General Hospital to see Curtis Ashford. Laura writes Carly Spencer is warned by Sunny Corinthos. Trina Robinson, Tabiana Alley, receives an open letter from Spencer Cassidine, Nicholas Alexander Chavez. Someone is going to receive unpleasant news from Maxie Jones, Kirsten Storms, and Lucy Coe. Sam McCall rips Kobe Bell to pieces. Sunny Corinthos at the General Hospital. Jordan Ashford visits Curtis Ashford in the General Hospital. Since being shot, Curtis's mental and emotional health have suffered. It's amazing Jordan hasn't visited before now, but she was probably unsure whether anyone in his family, let alone him, would accept her. What will Curtis think of seeing his ex? G.H. warns Sonny Corinto's Spencer Carly. When Sonny visits Kelly's, he will inquire with Carly about her trip to Pentonville that day. She was aware that his gift of freeing Drew Kane from isolation might have conditions, but she never considered Cyrus Renault to be one of them. 
Spencer's General Hospital hint Cassidine admits she was trying to Robinson. Spencer is about to reveal himself to his fiancé in a whole new way, which might help them regain their footing, something they both need lately. Discover the upcoming events on General Hospital. But that doesn't mean, as in princes, Avery Kristen Pohl, impending menace, will disappear Lucy Co. and Maxie Jones break some news. The information Lucy and Maxie have to share with Gladys Corbin won't make her happy. Given how many problems Sasha Gilmore Corbin has had in her personal life that are damaging the company's reputation, it's likely that they can't continue to consider having her on board with deception. Will Gladys reveal anything unexpected to Brooke Lynn Quartermain during this conversation? Hospital in general Kobe Bell is beaten by Sam McCall, a fresh one. Sam might learn something that changes the way she sees her relationship with Cody. Is she going to turn on him? Could this be connected to the favor Dan Falconeri requested from her? Drew and Carly reunite, and Liz experiences a show kiki. The characters in the most recent General Hospital episode, which airs on August 22, 2023, become embroiled in a web of riddles and secrets. Alliances are created and relationships are put to the test. There will be some intense scenes in the episode airing August 22-23, to 23, with Carly's worries for Drew's safety and Anna's tenacity in cracking a difficult case. To find out what's going on, keep reading. Drew's safety is a concern for Carly. In the General Hospital episode airing on August 22, 2023, Sunny gives Carly the chance to visit Drew in jail which causes her entire world to abruptly change. Drew has been released from his isolation cell. He'll be ecstatic to see Carly, but according to GH spoilers, her excitement won't last long. She will learn all the details of what took on behind jail. Questions regarding Drew's safety are raised by his action in saving Cyrus Renault's life. Carly has a deep instinct that Drew has been the target of a wicked person. She advises him to be cautious and watchful for his own safety. Hospital in general. Carly is still anxious. The will of General Hospital Anna to discover the truth. Dan Falconeri voiced his worries about Valentin Cassidine's dishonest actions back at the Port Charles Police Department. Down to questions Valentin's motivations. Anna Devane thinks the puzzle relates to Pikeman, nevertheless. Anna refuses to back down despite Dante's concerns and suggestion that she leave the investigation. Anna is motivated by her desire to identify the person responsible for the chaos in her life. With little else to cling to, this enigma turns out to be her only hope. Hospital in general. G.H. slash Anna is untrustworthy, connecting over shared secrets. Finn and Alexis. Additionally, according to General Hospital teasers, Finn is struggling to process the devastating news of his father's ALS diagnosis. He goes to Alexis for assistance, and the two of them go to an AA meeting together. Finn and Alexis have a lot to talk about now that Gregory Chase's illness has been made public. Alexis, who has been Gregory's rock, offers her assistance to Finn as well. As they manage their emotions and face the obstacles ahead, their bond grows stronger. Gregory is still having trouble, G.H. Gregory, meantime, is confronted with the sobering reality of his failing health as he gets sobering ALS updates. The seriousness of the matter becomes apparent at his consultation with Dr. Bronson. Gregory talks on the need for any help he can obtain in the company of T.J. Ashford. Despite the challenges, Gregory's openness with Finn gives Finn some optimism as he finds someone else to rely on in this difficult situation. Elizabeth and Austin's new dynamic at General Hospital Elizabeth finds herself assisting Austin in patient care as the drama on General Hospital plays out. Concerns regarding the patient's identification are raised by Hudson West's return in the role of Jake Weber. Could Jake really be the one in need of medical care? Elizabeth wonders if Austin will remember her from somewhere else after the professional encounter. Thanks for watching if you liked this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.